Ron Gooder from FightHype.com, New York Casters Cheney. Congratulations on your win. How are you doing? I feel good. You know, it's been a long camp and uh, this fight has been long overdue. You know, he's been calling me out for a few years, so yeah, he got it and you know, it, it went the way it went, you know. What was the story like you said he was calling you out? Or? Um, yeah, we were supposed to fight maybe like three years ago. And uh, the fight didn't happen. I don't know why it didn't happen. It wasn't either one of our fault, really. And um, But he posted on Facebook he had a body bag for me. You know, my mom saw it. Everybody saw it. So I've been holding on to that for a few years. And boom, they asked me about him fighting him. I said, yeah, I want to. I definitely want to fight him. He never been knocked down. He never been knocked out. So the challenge was there. He's fought some good guys. He's always made it tough getting draws and stuff. But... I figured that um, athletically, I'll definitely be more athletic than him, and uh, I think I showed it tonight. Do you, do you think that's the proper way to get him out of there by knocking him out of the range? <laughs> you know, you know, you're probably gonna go viral tonight about that, right? Hey, you know what's crazy? They messed up my knockout by by letting him get back in the ring, man. Come on, man. He fell head first out the ring, but you know, he's a tough guy. Like obviously, I thought when he got back in, he was just going to start throwing wild. So I try to stay, you know, kind of calm, but. You know, I'm getting better, I'm getting stronger, and, um, you know, in due time, in due time. So what's next for you? Uh, where you going from here? You I don't know. I, I do want to fight, you know, um, some guys with some hype maybe, like Niall Kennedy, uh, Joe Casamano possibly. There's some guys out there for me that make good fights for me. Um, they, I don't know, They he was supposed to make a decent fight for me, but it ain't happened like that. And... Uh, I just figured, like, there's some guys out there that make good fights for me that that I'll get better with, and that's what I want to do. Uh, would you want to fight in Sergey's undercard uh, with, uh, in Russia? In Russia? I would love to. I would love to fight in Russia, but man, I heard that flight like 15 hours. I don't know if I can do 15 hours like on a flight. I don't react well to flying long distances, but of course I'll do it. I, so far, I've always performed under the lights, ESPN, the HBO cards. I've done well on those type of cards, so uh, I'm just thankful and I'm blessed and I'm thankful for main events of top rank for putting me on. Can we talk a little bit here? Like, from when I first known you, you got the nice big afro. Yeah. And you came it down. And oh, the fro coming back. Okay. It's, it's about time it come back. You know, I was just going through a little transition with my hair, you know, always getting it done and stuff, keeping up with it. Um, it's coming back. It's, it'll be back this winter. <laughs> you know what I mean? It'll be back this winter. So I'm looking forward to it. Kathy, um, Kathy Duva, my, my promoter, she just said to me, grow it back. So, it back. yeah, so I'm, I'm getting my hair back. I'm getting it back. Okay. Now, I have to ask you a couple of uh, fight predictions. Uh, you know, you're a great fight yourself. Uh, Manny Pacquiao and Thurman is the big fight on Saturday. So, do you have a winner in that fight between those two? <sighs> Man, I just wanted to be a great fight, but Thurman gave me some advice before, before, before he became champion. And um, I appreciate him for that, so I'm gonna have to go with Thurman. Even though I like Pacquiao, cause it's Pacquiao. He's a good, he's a cool guy. But Thurman gave me some advice a long time ago, back when I first started boxing. Didn't know me on Facebook, and I gotta go with him for that. You know. Was it like spiritual advice or boxing advice? I just asked him some things about lifting weights with me being a big guy and things like that. And he told me he didn't really lift weights, just shadow box with you know the weights and stuff like that. And you know. Um, it was cool because he ain't know me, and I was just hitting people up when I was first starting out. So I'm going with Thurman. Now, um, a rematch in your division: Deontay Wilder versus Stevenson to be on the fight. You have a winner in that fight. Man, that's tough, man. I really believe Ortiz can upset the apple card. I really believe that Ortiz is a live body. He's smart. Um, he he had him he had him out the first fight, but. You can't count Wild out, man. He, he, you know what I mean. He figure out, he figure out, he durable too. But I don't know. It might, it might be a draw. It might be a draw. Yeah. I, I might, I might go with a draw because Ortiz. If Ortiz don't get knocked out, it, it's gonna be a draw. What about uh, another kind of 50-50 to people? Errol Spence and Sean Porter. Do we have uh, a winner in that? The fight supposed to be announced soon. I don't know. It's tough, right? Yeah, that's a tough fight because Earl, Earl, Sean Porter can take Errol Spence punches because his weight. But uh, I don't know. That's a tough fight. But if I had to choose from a boxing standpoint, I'm going with Errol Spence. Awesome. Anything else that you're working on in the process of uh, you know leaving the next 48 hours, going home, relaxing, or going back into the gym? 
Um, I'll probably be in the gym tomorrow to do a little something, uh, not heavy. Um, nah, man, I'm probably go to the movies tomorrow or something, you know. Lion King? Not Lion King. I, I watched that for free today. No, nah, I shouldn't say that on camera. <laughs> uh, but I'll probably go see uh, Crawl, the little alligator joint in the movies. So, yeah, nothing really. Oh, Dillian White and Oscar Reeves fight tomorrow, so I'm going to watch the heavyweight. Dillian White, Oscar Rivas, I don't know. I just hope it's a good fight. You know, I hope it's a good fight. Well, on social media for fans to follow you in your journey, obviously you're going to go viral tonight. Uh, <laughs> uh, Cash and Chaney on Instagram, Twitter, Facebook. Um, that's it, really. Uh, I'm on there when I'm on there. You know what I mean? And thank you, Fight Hype, man. I, I read Fight Hype every day. I go on that site every day. So, thank you. Yeah, thank you.